Quadriceps, rectus femoris, modified Thomas test. With the patient in supine, at the very edge of the table, with both legs off the edge of the bed, the patient must then flex their knee and pull it back to their chest as close as they can. The other leg can hang down. Make sure that the lumbar spine stays in neutral and that the upper leg stays tight to the chest. Next, flex the knee. Measure the hip extension with the axis of motion at the greater trochanter and the static arm horizontal. Measure the angle from the horizontal plane into hip extension with the moving arm down the thigh to the centre of the femoral condyle. Also measure knee flexion with the axis of motion in the centre of the lateral side of the knee with one arm to the greater trochanter and the other arm to the lateral malleoli. Norms, 10 degrees hip extension with 90 degrees knee flexion according to McKean 2004.